Good afternoon yet again ladies and gents, guest Gex back again with a bit more Fallout New Vegas. In the previous part we went in there and beat up some Cazadors and got some bonuses and found a holotape and we're still looking for Muggy's files. Nope. Is that another Cazador? It is! Moving like a... Oh, here we go. Moving like a Cazador. We got a bit of a damage bonus against them which was... Here we go. Which was pretty cool. So I, I, I'm seriously hoping that we're able to actually land some hits on this because, as I say, if we can get there, we go. In, in the previous time we did that, two hits would not have been enough to kill that. But because we got as a Casador death dealer, because we got the the bonus, we were able to kill it with two shots, which is awesome. And we're getting loads of these poison glands, which is pretty cool. So we're heading over there to that building there, and we're going to try and find the last of these tapes. As I say, and get Muggy, our little mini robot, up and running. We've got most of the tapes now, but um, I mean, this is arguably what's going on? Oh, for God's sake, arguably a little bit pointless because once we leave the big MT, we are almost certainly not coming back. But. Um, Hiding around the rock till my AP builds up again. There we go. I do love this gun, I really do. I must admit, it's worth doing the DLC just for this gun. Not that the DLC is bad, it's, it's not too bad, but. Uh... Oh. We don't need any of that guff. So, anyway, we'll carry on. <gasps> There's a holotape! You need to go in the building. Muggy! There he is. Yeah. We do love, we love Muggy. Oh, I love Muggy. Nice. So all we need to do now is go back and install them. How, oh, what now? What the hell is that thing? Oh my God, that's like Victor. Oh, I've not seen one of him before. Anyway. Okay, I'm going to put a save point down. Um, yeah, just to remind you all, this is, remember, only a one-life playthrough, so if we die, that's it. End of end of playthrough. But um, we're doing alright so far. I've got all the way up to here uh, without dying. But then, of course, Fallout is not a difficult game, to be honest. You, you know, I think you'd agree. Where the bloody hell is he going? She going? He's actually going to walk around the corner, isn't he? Like a bell end. Ugh. Nice. Now he's supposed to become dismembered when you um. Yeah, I'll take all of that because we're going to need that for weapon repair kits. Yeah, he's supposed to become dismembered with our special funky thing, but that didn't that didn't happen. But anyway, I don't know. I may change back to the other one. I do love, I do love having a rummage. Giggle, giggle. What is this place? Securitron deconstruction plant. Interesting. So where did that other Securitron go? I know he's about. There he is. Oh, buggering hell. Slightly concerned that he's got missiles, but I don't know. Sodding blueberries. Sorry, I've got, got a blueberry pip thing stuck in my teeth. There we go. There we go. I know that's not exactly entirely relevant, but still. I felt it needed to be said. Are you telling me this has an even less range than the other one? He has got missiles. Oh Christ. Nice. That could have been messy. That... Oh, you. I thought that I misread that. I thought when I was reading the subtitles it said they're being strangely quiet. T100 quiet. I was like, what the hell? What's a T100? We're not going to go in this building just yet, I don't think. I'd rather... 
Uh, sorry, I'd rather go back and install those thingy me bobs. Just having a quick peek over here. I know this is essentially the limit to how far we can go, but because uh, of those stupid pylons. But uh, yay! No, I think that I, I'm not even going. I'm not even going to risk it because I'll probably end up accidentally getting murdered. Now I don't know what's over there. There's something. There's a red dot over there. I don't quite know what it is. Nice, loads of ammo. Oh great, another one of them. Another one of them. Now two shots have sort of been enough up till now to knacker them. Yeah, it is. There we go. Yeah, don't really need scrap metal to be honest. I bet you we get back to our thing, and I try and make um try and make a weapon repair kit, and we're one scrap metal short. Jesus, look at all this! Nice, nice. The only reason I'm taking three fifty-seven rounds is because the bulldog, which I've now upgraded, uses three fifty-seven. I assumed it was an energy weapon, but it's oh my god! But it's actually not. What are those? Are they Cazadors? Because they're moving. Jeez, there's a lot of them. Oh no, it's Lobotomites. Do I dare? No, I don't know. I don't know. It's not really. There's not really any perk for doing that, is there, to be honest? Except we would get a load of ammo and stuff from them. Oh, it would mean having to go down there, though, wouldn't it? Oh, I don't know. I don't know. I am slightly confused as to what they're actually doing. But anyway. Uh. I'm also... I knew it. I knew they weren't all down the bottom. I knew it. If we end up in, if we are, we cannot engage them in a long range fight because I don't, I don't have the accuracy for that sort of thing. Um, yeah, I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. What we'll do, let's get out of here, let's bug out of here, and then we will, we'll have a quick peek in the deconstruction plant because if if it is, if it is a total nightmare, we can just go running out the door again, slamming it behind us as we go. But. Um, and screaming for our mothers. Are there any? I wonder if there's any star caps here at all. I haven't picked up a star cap for. I can't even remember when the last one was. But anyway, they seem quite rare. Anyway, never mind. Never mind. You think there'd be some, wouldn't you? Never mind. Right, we'll stick our head in the door, and then, as I say, if it's a, if it's a disaster, we'll we'll come back out again. I'm pelting back out again. So yes, as I mentioned in the previous part, so I can't decide what to do with my Fallout 4 pre-order official t-shirt, which is awesome. I must be like the first person to have one of those. It's awesome. I don't even work for game or anything. It's so cool. Yeah, Mum. Oh, come on. Look at this. Danger. Immediately. I like the fact there's a toilet directly behind the reception desk. I have. Oh, hello. I have. Oh, what's happened? There's not even any red dots. That's what's irritating. There's like no red dots. What has seen me? Okay, here's a red dot. Oh! Nice sneak attack. This gun is just the best, it really is. See again, I, I don't know whether it is the game being bent and just saying, yeah, danger, when there's actually nothing about it. Hey. But, or, or whether there is in fact something that is looking at me and thinking, I'm going to kill you in a minute. I, don't, I really don't know. Guessing there's something up there. 
Right, let's have a little peek. The music doesn't help as well, because sometimes if it's, if it's just the game glitching, then the music probably wouldn't be kicking off as well. I'm really scared. Christ almighty, I didn't even see that until it was nearly too late. Jeez! I don't even know what that means. It's obviously um, binary for something, but something, anyway. Let's lob. Where's it gone? Pulse grenade. Jesus! Well, that did a fair bit of damage, it has to be said. That did a fair bit of damage. Unfortunately, we haven't really got... Okay, one more hit and he's knackered. If anyone knows what that is binary for, please let me know. I'll probably look it up, actually. But... Is that him all the way? Nice! Nice! There we go. Slight excessive fire there, but anyway. Look at that, I mean, we only levelled up a little while ago, and already we're nearly halfway through again. That's awesome. Must, there must be a workbench in here somewhere. <gasps> Parts production? I'll put, sorry, I'll put my pit boy light on. It's obviously a little bit dark. There we go. Um... Oh yes, nice. And a proton throwing axe. And we're probably over encumbered. No, nearly. We must be nearly over encumbered. Okay, can't open them. What the hell is that? Oh, didn't know, didn't know what that was. Mentats, they don't weigh anything. And does the thingy work? No, oh, of course it doesn't. Let's have a little wander down here, see what's at the on the uh, bottom floor. Not a lot by the looks of it. An automated hoover. Hang on, how the hell do we get up there? Oh, hello. How did that happen? How did he get there? Interesting. Ah, uh, you see, that's the other exit. We did see two exits, didn't we? But anyway, right. I'm not finished exploring the other place. Hard hats required. Fair dues. Oh, stupid hunger level. Hang on. Uh, we can eat them. Nice. Probably shouldn't, but... <gasps> One, There we go. Nice. So I say, if we can find... Oh, you bumpy. If we can find um, a workbench... We can uh, we start cranking out some weapon repair kits, hopefully. Oh. Oh, see, I wish I could just instantly transport all this stuff back. Very intrigued by it when it says parts production from Muggy. I do wonder what he can make. Our little buddy. I don't think he's actually that useful. That didn't freak me out at all. Um... Yeah, I don't know if he's like. I don't think he's like massively useful, but still. Poor dude. Poor dude. Nothing in the safe. Interesting. I wonder if there there was. I wonder. I mean, there must have been something of import in there, but uh, interesting. What was stolen from the safe? Place your guesses, ladies and gents. What was stolen from the safe? Anyway, we need to get down. I can't find the stairs. They're on the other side of the door. That would be why. No, they're not. We'll just jump. There we go. So we haven't been down here, have we, I don't think? No. We clearly haven't been down here. I was going to say, how could there not be a workbench? Right. Oh my god, then. Oh my god, hang on. I'm just going to, yeah. And duct tape as well. Yoink. We must be able to make at least one weapon repair kit, if not more. Two. Nice. And we can recycle a couple of energy cells. Probably recycle a few of them. K 
Can we convert anything else? No. What else do we need if we wanted to make another weapon repair kit? We would still need duct tape, electronics, and two scrap metal. Okay, we can do that. Duct tape, electronics. So all we need now is duct tape. To do the duct tape. Which there must be lying about in this place somewhere. You would think, anyway, having said that, you you would think there would be duct tape lying about. Maybe not, maybe not. It is actually surprisingly rare. But, uh... Yeah. Um... Are you kidding me? There really is. There's like no, there's no duct tape. That's that's amazing. No, nope, there's not even any in there. That's because that's an ashtray. I know it looks like a a bit, a bit like a roll of duct tape, but it ain't. Come on, don't let me down. Damn you! You let me down. Um, the hell? Right. There must be some somewhere. Oh, damn it! Don't think stupid wrench. Everything but duct tape. As I say, you don't. I've got to admit, you don't actually see it that often, do you? Well, we'll take that anyway. We don't really need that, to be honest. Come on, you stupid receptionist! How could you not have any duct tape? No. Sat behind her desk swigging coke the whole day. There is, there's like no duct tape, that's amazing. Urgh. Hmm. That is irritating, that is very irritating actually, because I say that's all we need, we just need that one thing. Urgh. Shelves of everything. Oh. And also, we could make loads of bottle cap mines if we had to, if we had the uh, schematic. But no, but no. Damn it! Oh, make sure it is duct tape we need. I'm, I'm sure it is, but oh yeah, never mind, never mind. No, nope, I'm gonna have to give up. Sorry, I'm sorry, I'm gonna have to give up. Right, we are going to. Uh, head back, install those files, and then we can actually make a proper start on some of the uh, some of the proper missions in this. But um, we're going to take down Doctor Mobius, the evil Doctor Mobius. I think hell, I feel tired. I feel so tired. But anyway, anyway, there's not even. I don't think there's even any duct tape out here. Just have a quick look in the back of this lorry. Ugh. Rubbish. Hmm. Oh well. Never mind. We'll fast travel back because we've got some stuff to drop off anyway. Um. So, yeah, drop off some stuff, sell some stuff, install those components and see what it can do. I don't have to say, I can't remember what mo Muggy can do for it. Oh! Backsides. I forgot to be picking up, um blank books and stuff because we can take books from here and put them in the chute I believe you can make skill magazines I think or something like that I can't remember we'll have a look anyway to the sink should really save before too long as well because we've done a fair bit to be honest we don't want to lose all our progress I know people do whinge about the game crashing a lot, but the game has got a lot con to contend with. It's not just some linear shooter type thing. It's actually got a lot to to do. And it's an old game. It is an old game, to be honest. But, uh, seriously hoping Fallout 4 doesn't have any massive <laughs> glitches or anything. Right, let's get Muggy up and running first. Muggy! You! Hey, you! Yeah, you! Got any mugs? Um... Mugs? Why do you want mugs? Why do you want mugs, huh? You some kind of sick mug hoarder? Oh god, give me the coffee cup, please! It's sitting there in your back, taunting me! Sorry, I'm sorry. I gotta carry away. 
It's just all those goddamn dirty dishes out there with no one to clean them. It breaks my heart. Um, you seem obsessed with bugs. Of course I'm obsessed. They made me this way. You think I don't know how crazy I sound? Of course I do. They programmed me to know that too. They made me just to torture me. But you know, it's the neglect that hurts the most. Hey, everybody, let's turn ourselves into robot brains and jaw. Giant robot brains and jars use on a daily basis? Not fucking many! What do you do with them, Bugs? I can't remember what he does do with them, actually. I'm supposed to keep them clean. Oh, God! The pot of all those dirty dishes out there makes me crazy. Most of them are probably beyond saving now. The only thing left is break them down and process them for raw materials. I guess you can have those. Um, can you do anything else? Anything else, he asks. Like, I don't long for the chance to be more than an erotic bus boy. If you must know, at one point, Dr. Mobius programmed me to manufacture electronic components in my central chassis. That module got corroded when the toaster spilled hot pumps down my fence, though. Can you find a backup somewhere? I can maybe do that for you. Hmm. Uh, right. We're going to leave him for the moment, but sure. we'll keep a lookout for mug Nobody for mugs. So I'll be back, you big baby. Right. What else have we got? There we go. Mm, that was a nice little uh, cat nap. How long was I out? Um. Uh, what are you? Some kind of novelty talking light switch? I was Dr. Mobius's personal assistant. We were studying, um, oh shoot, what was it? Oh yeah. oh yeah, lightning. No, no, wait, uh, lighting. That's right, how lighting affects human interaction. And what did you find out? Oh, oh it was super exciting. It turns out that some pretty colored lights can make you way better at talking to people. Can you turn on those lights for me? Oh, oh I'd love to, sweetie, but I... You'd have to go out into that nasty old crate. Damn it! Oh, her. Trust me, sweetie, you're better off not thinking about that frigid little ice queen. <laughs> um. That bitch, she thinks she's so much better than everybody just because her processors are bigger. Ooh, she makes me so mad. I uh, forget I said anything. Cat fight. Sure thing, sweetie. Uh, right, okay, so what else do we need to do? Um, right, so we've turned on that one. We've done the book shoot, we've done the auto... Hang on, can we put anything else into the dock? There we go. M5, what does it do? Let's find out what M5 does. Um, M5, increased speed while crouched. That's pretty good. Although it is 10,000 caps. Christ. Uh, nothing for the moment, thank you. What's the other thing we need to do then? So we've done that one. We've done the sink. Oh god, I really am confused as to what the other one is. Um, yeah, install the personalities. So personality uh, thingies in the. Um, in the missing, but that's that's where we are. But Lord knows I have. She's just such a Lucy. How can I illuminate you? Oh, so okay, we can't do that either. Um, Maggie, upgrade holotape parts production. Okay, supply of energy cells and scrap metal. Nice. Oh, please, please tell me you me he seriously needs to chill out, doesn't he? Um, have you made any electronic components? Nice! Oh, uh, hang on, I still need to... Oh, it's so irritating. I can't remember what the last thing is that we need to install. We've... Oh. Yeah, you see, we've done that one. That obviously doesn't do anything. Then There's one more somewhere, because we've got 9 out of 10. I can't remember where it is. 
Yeah. Anyway, um, six off the sinks personality. Why would we do that? Why would we want to do that? Let's see what we can sell. I can't remember. We've got some cacao to sell. We can sell that, 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 them because we're never going to use them. Um, scientist gloves. See again, we're not really going to use that to be honest. Um, all that. What's the difference then? Health regeneration, endurance plus one. What's the difference? I don't understand what the what anyway. Um, we're gonna sell some crap. We're actually gonna hang on to Hydra this time because we may need it because we do keep running out of um, thingy bobs. Um, doctor's bags. Sorry. Uh, Yeah, we've got, quite a, we've got quite a few of this sort of stuff as well. Wow, loads of them. It's mega now. Um, actually, I may as well, to be honest, leave it there to be, uh, and just have a little sort through and then we can start. Mm. Nice. And then we can sort of start a new part very soon. So thank you very much for watching um, and I shall see you again very, very soon.